Greetings everyone and welcome back to Victoria 2. I'm your host, Senor Mocha Lover, and right now on screen you can see that we have a Casas Bella against, of all nations, Colombia, which we get Panama, Antioquia, and Cauca. Cool! So hopefully we can do that. Got a lot of comes to go through, but why Colombia? Well, I decided against, well, I originally chose China because someone recommended in the comments that we should go take Manchuria. But I tried that off screen, actually I tried it and I recorded it. But we got our butts handed to us from China. At least I had my butt handed to me. Maybe not yours, but definitely my butt. Because I didn't realize the Chinese know how to use artillery. I guess I should have figured that since they did probably invent gunpowder. So, hey, whatever. Uh, regardless, we want to go to war with these guys. And I did it off screen just because, well, war justification. There's still so much saves coming that has to occur. I mean, my goodness, so much saves coming. Regardless, we're ready to go to war. We're probably calling our allies. And we got to go to Colombia. Hopefully things don't go poorly for us. But like I said, we got a lot of comes. Go through it. First one is... Someone recommends, actually quite a few people recommend, I play as the Ottoman Empire. I do plan on playing as the Ottoman Empire eventually in HPM, or maybe even HFM. Probably HPM though, but we'll see what happens. We'll get there when we get there. Uh, other comments as well. Become nationalists currently, and end, end forced labor as we'll call it. Yeah, forced labor has its uses, mostly because I want to get reforms done. That's the only reason why we still have this, you know, sl slavery and such. But also we got the reform, public meetings are allowed, so now, and the Tukulor Empire, we're 8th in the world right now, for great power. We can meet publicly. Go figure. And the reason why we're 8th in the world is because Turkey, or the Ottoman Empire, has a lot more prestige. They have, obviously everyone above us has a lot more factories than us. But we have actually bigger military than them, but they have a lot more prestige. Because, I'm not sure why. Uh, maybe just Ottoman things. Uh, I'm not really sure why. Hmm. Ottoman Egypt, of course, but whatever. Alright, let's go see what we can do. And I think, oh, I will call them the UK, just to make this a little bit easier. We want Panama, Antilcalcoalaba, and Calca. Let's take a look. What I really wanted was the coal over here, and in the A word. But I do want Panama. I think pa getting Panama would actually be pretty nice. And I, okay, so the real reason why I wanted to come to Colombia is because even though I couldn't take Manchuria because we're too weak, I wanted the coal just so that we could have it. And these guys do have some precious metals, which is kind of nice. And they have some good populations around here. But then we get Panama. We could construct the Panama Canal eventually. That would be actually a huge boost to our economy. So. I think I want to grab coal first, and if we have time, we're going to try to take Panama as well. So let's try to do this. So we take Antioquia, and I apologize if I'm pronouncing that wrong, because I know I am. We're calling our allies, because the UK will intervene on our behalf. And obviously, people don't like that, but hey, as long as we win, that's what matters, right? Hey, look at that. And they probably assume leadership? Yes, they have. As long as they get my province, that's all I care about. And actually, this is still... This, we can make this into a port, so... Nice. Very, very good. Other comments include, population growth is very, very important, and you need to assimilate more people. Yes. I will eventually. We'll get there eventually. Hopefully. Yeah. I, mean, I know. We need a massive... Oh, hello. Population. Hey, you showed up, and we made you go boom. You showed up, and we made you go boom. Oh, are, are the Brits going... Oh, they've already landed. You know what? I think the war's done. Cool. Let's go ahead and move our ships over and maybe grab another army, because we're starting to run out of army capacity over here. Yeah, that'd probably be good. Yeah. Also, we're researching medicine. Last time we finished or started doing functionalism, but I decided to do medicine just because that helps us get to other things here. More population growth, first of all, and you need it to help civilize other areas. So we got to do that one. We also need to get, I think we said yesterday, nationalism and imperialism. Actually, that'd be really good to get anyways. But, state and government. It's a mission to civilize, so. Good, we need to definitely get that one. And then, which one was it? Obviously, we need more research points and biologism. So, we definitely need that. And there's one more, I forget. Oh, yeah, it was machine guns, breach loaded rifles, colonial negotiations. Yeah. I mean, there's so much we have to do, but I want to get as much research point as possible. We need to get more uh, education efficiency as possible, so. And unfortunately, yesterday, we did have to end child labor. And it is what it is. It's not really the thing I wanted to do, but, you know, we kind of had to do that. Let's see. Turinja, Bogota. I would like to take the Panama City region. Mm, supply wise, it's all just god awful. I'll, I'll go to Panama City first, though. Ask it. Uh, mm, supply's so bad around here, though. Yep, go, go to Panama City. Screw it. Go to Panama City. Also, we gotta increase our relations with our little puppet here. Because we love our puppet. We love Bolivia. Hey, we got it. Nice. Look at this. More supply limit. That's actually really good for us. Very good. Mm, getting another. Focus actually might be really good. Plurality, a lot more plurality, more social 
Shots justice stuff for consciousness and non-colonial. Political reform desire is good as well. I really want this. That's so many points, though. And the getting more education efficiency is bad. I I gotta go this one, and then we'll grab some colonial negotiations probably then. Oh, hello. I'm gonna let the Brits deal with that. Our, I love our army, but it's just not good enough yet. Hopefully we can get what we need. Oh. And the reason I did want to do Panama City because it's better supply around here too. Hey, the Brits are doing okay-ish. A little bit of lag, it's okay. Oh, they're slowly losing... Oh, 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 maybe the Brits are gonna get... Oh, uh oh, uh oh. The Brits got slapped by the Colombians. Oh, man. Yeah, I'm glad I called him in. Let's get some more guys on a boat and head on over again. It's time to Panama City. And having two armies here will actually help out. Even the British get slapped down by Colombians from time to time. Very good. And we do have some factories. There was a comment for me to build up, like, clothes, cement factories, glass factories, clothes factories, all that good stuff in places and regions where we can have high population as well as high levels of railroads eventually. So, that'll be good to do. Thank you for playing. Come on down to... Uh, da -da -da. Go, right here, go, go right there. That'll be good. And once we have Panama City, we can rest our ships. And obviously that'll be a very, very, very good thing. Having you guys here as well definitely helps out too. Oh, we need, definitely need this area too. Oh! Oh! Oh, why would you do that? You're attacking into the mountains, yes! Oh, minus... Oh, that is disgusting. Minus three. Zero for a dice roll. Minus one and minus one. Oh, that is... That is brutal. That is a great British victory right there. I love the Brits some days. Beautiful. And you guys can come on down here and kind of hang out. You don't need to spend or make your ships even worse. Other oh, comments. Become national and slavery. I think I might have already read that one. I don't know. I can't think anymore. Actually, I can. I just don't remember a lot. Let's see. We should create Wakanda to do so. Maybe. We'll see what happens. I'm not opposed to that at all. Create Wakanda. Population growth is key to and many similar people. Build factory. Well, food and alcohol industry, which is probably pretty important to do. So we'll do that probably as well. And you guys come down here. And you're still being sieged down, which is not bad. Ooh, we can't propose peace because we're not the leaders. We'll see what happens. Hopefully they don't get a white piece. That would not be very good for us. Let's see. Play as China, but don't try to tag switch. Like, don't, like, you have to stay as China. Don't tag switch to anyone else, which is fine, but... And also play as Sarawak. Well, the Chinese... Well, that sounds pretty difficult to me, but... I mean, I, maybe I'll play as China someday. I'm not opposed to it, so... That just sounds very, very difficult. Are you... You're going to attack me while I'm in the jungle. And you have smaller force. Oh, okay, no, the Brits just help us out there. Okay. The Brits are just marching in. Okay, well, I mean... I don't want to siege this area down because it's not good for our, our soldiers and we get a lot of attrition. But hey, you know what? You kill them off. You do you, guys. You do you. And Awesome. I I'm not sure what else to say. Just awesome. I love the Brits when they're on our side. Then again, that's probably what a lot of people think too. Oh god, the attrition here is so bad. So bad. We're barely making some money. Oh, who is that? Algeria? Um, sure. Why not? Oh, we have an army up here, too. That's kind of nice. Yeah, a lot of colonial provinces, too. Cool, but we're more interested in this. Uh, the Brits? Yep, the Brits have shown up here, too. That's okay with me. Bogata is obviously under siege. Good luck, guys. Good luck killing them. Take more of Morocco to make prettier borders. Yes, I do hope to do that. Look at that. Another astounding victory for the Tukular Empire today, as it's now become clear that Antiochia will, as has been expected for some time, will be taken up into the Tukular patrimony with the full rights of national statehood. One question remains still, though, is to settle this, however. The issue of slavery. It can be extended within a country, and the question on the table is whether we wish to extend the institution to the region or not. Shall we extend it? We will not, because we don't want that much slavery here. And I'm going to leave you guys here, because supply is really bad. <sighs> It's an actual state we can use. Fertilizer, sulfur... No, nah, well, we have glass works. I mean, we could do that here, I guess. Why not? Alright, great. So I'll have you guys come over to... Oh, actually, that's a lot of supply here. Not bad. You guys come over here. I also have one army back home, so... Nice. Very, very good. Thank you, UK. I love the UK. 
That looks really disgusting. I'll be honest, that's just disgusting. Venezuela? Should we unite our borders? What? Do they have any good RGOs around here? They got coffee. I don't... Hmm. Oh, that's another one, though. You know, I'm thinking maybe ahead of time. Which parts of Venezuela should have oil? I don't think this place has oil, does it? Hmm. Hmm. We could make a most puppet, but... Hmm. I prefer direct rule from... Segu. That is disgusting, guys. Please stop that. Cool. And we do have two industry. Uh, good. We're moving you guys over. That is awesome, awesome, awesome. And gonna hang out, guys. Oh my gosh, that is not good. I love the Brits. That helps us out so much. That's another comment was, take out Persia and maybe spear some countries? Oh yeah, we could spear some countries. That's, that's a good idea. Persia, they are partially westernized. And we're already justifying on the other group. Maybe, we'll, maybe we will, maybe we won't. If I can call in the UK to help us out, I don't mind puppeting them. Oh, that would be good. As puppet. Yeah, we'll puppet, puppet, puppet them next. Nah, so send you guys home. Actually, hmm. Yeah, I'll puppet. We'll send you guys home. Or if, uh, I guess if we are going there. We don't really have to send you home. Get off, the, get off the boat. Just kind of stay here and hang out. Very nice. And who do we want to like sphere? I'm not really sure who I want to sphere really. Madagascar? I mean, they're in, they're in the French sphere. Can I fight for Egypt? That'd be kind of cool. Is that really worth it? I, hmm. What if I sphered Spain? Not Egypt, but Spain. We could try, maybe. They're only nine, so it probably wouldn't be that great. How about... What if instead of Spain? Portugal. Oh, the Brits really have them, but hey, maybe we can get uh, Portugal under us. That'd be kind of nice. Ooh, and we still are spending quite a bit on the budget. Let's lower that. Let's lower that. 500 something. We're going to keep taxes high for over there. Can we lower this instead? Lower more tariffs so we can get more goods in the country. Let's see. Other comments. Build core industries in the most populated states. And I want to build industries here as well because this is where we have a lot of good potential infrastructure as well. It's not a core state, which kind of sucks, but it is what it is. Also, build in high railroad provinces, the rates of fertilizers. Oh, look at that. England is robbing all other countries of the conditions of the fertility. Already in her eagerness for bones, she has turned up the battlefields of Leipzig and Waterloo. Already from the catacombs of Sicily, she has carried away the skeletons of many successive generations. Like a vampire, she hangs upon the neck of Europe, nay, of the entire world, and sucks the heart blood from nations without a thought of justice towards them, without a shadow of lasting advantage for herself. As the competition for the phosphates and sulfurs for fertilizer production heats up, several Tukolo geologists report finding a new source of the desired product in Horikba. Horiba. Horibka. What the heck is that? Hey, I love our colonial, the, the Madagascar and Madagascar, Marrakesh settlements. Hey, vaccinations, we, vaccines, you know what they cause? A healthier populace. <laughs> ah, I love it. So you guys are next on the, on the uh, docking list. So we have three, so one, two, and then up to seven. Boom, there we go. Beautiful. And I'll see you all in just a little bit. All right, everyone, and we're back, and right now, we're looking at Zanzibar. But, well, I wanted to go to war with Venezuela, but unfortunately, the gosh darn Americans got involved. And what I don't like with the Americans, they just want to take everything away from us, which really, really, really sucks. Oh, they actually fixed the borders, too. Look at that. But instead, oh, oh hello. What are you guys doing? Um, we have decided to go to war with Persia and puppet them. Now, I've tried this once off screen, but... We're not going to call in the UK, because when I tried it off scream, the UK decided to not allow me to get them as a puppet, but for them to take another province, so we're not going to call in the UK in this war. So we'll see what happens. Hopefully we can do well. Hopefully things don't go poorly for us, so we'll see what happens. Regardless, uh, getting Persia as a puppet was probably pretty good, even though the Russians might want to go to war with them eventually, but we'll see what happens. All right, auto-saving. Put you guys on a boat and head on over to the Strait of Hormuz. I'm going to Jask first because that's probably the best place for supply. And we're also having analytic philosophy being done. We have state controlled trade unions. No draft, which actually hurts a little bit. Ooh, that does hurt education, so whatever. Yeah, very good. Very good. Very, very good. Oh, we're here. Great. 
Alright, they have 26 military score, which is not bad. We're gonna make them a puppet. Anyways, we're not gonna call them the UK this time, because we don't need to, hopefully. And do that, and as soon as we land, we are gonna go ahead and grab another army down somewhere. Hopefully, for the love of God, oh, hopefully, yeah, oh, you guys. We don't even grab them, just come on over. Cool. And I'm gonna have you guys... Hmm... You know, we'll put both armies here, then. Put both navies. Help us area down a little bit faster. Nah, never mind. We, we gotta grab another army. That'd be good. Nice. Hopefully we can p kill them off, but we'll see what happens. Ooh, look at that. We got some better army hospitals. Army nutrition. Combat medicine. Hey, look at that. That's pretty good. Oh, hello, shippies. You must die. We're gonna grab Bandar Abbas next, just because that's a good port to grab. So we're gonna repair shippies. Ooh, also, let's see. Peru likes us, kind of. Want an alliance, Peru? No. Bolivia. Call ally? Sure, why not? Actually, I should probably be influencing them, too. That's probably a good thing to do. Probably. Probably. Hopefully we don't lose their great power status. I don't. I really don't want to lose that. Hey, here you go. You guys can come over here. Cha Bahar. Oh. And... Who, who do you want to increase the relations with? Belgium? Sure. Hello, Belgium. I hope you like us. Oh, we got it. Nice. Kashem. Very good. Very good. Let's see if it's done quickly. Uh, they have some... Ooh. There's an army over there that we probably need to take out. 12.6% of our population can read those. That's not too bad. They have no artillery, which is good, good, good. Great. I'm going to have you move you guys over here now. And then you guys come over. Let them come in first. Come to Jask in three days. Three, two. Boom. Let's go. Let's go. Nice. Lenga. Very good, very good, very good. And where are you going? No, son. No, 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 no. You must go bye-bye. And let's see. Yep, hey, Puppet Castle Bella, which is very nice. Oh, come on, man. Alright, so you, you trapped yourselves right there. You literally trapped yourselves right there, which is a good thing. Ooh, that's a lot of guys, though. That's, that's a lot of infantry, though. Hey, look at that. Beautiful. Actually, we're losing quite a few guys. Why are we losing... <clears throat> Excuse me. We are losing more because we are taking over a river, which sucks, but hey, at least they're trapped here. And I want you guys to hopefully do well over here. Uh, no, go this way. Go through the land. We don't want to land on there like that. Ooh, the general... Oh, not Ibrahim is gone. No, 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 no. Uh, I don't want to cause too many casualties. You just kind of hang out for now. Oh, we got to kill these guys off too. Ooh, Portugal. Increased relations. That's good. Portugal. Hey, nice. Let's give up there and go up to Bam, and go that there maybe. Good. We just killed eighteen thousand off. We got three point three more score. How much war score do we need to actually take them out? Because Persia is quite a large group here. We have fifteen war score. We need eighty-five. Gosh darn. If they leave, they leave on the tenth. Let's hold on. Oh, actually, now we go. They'll leave pretty quickly. Yeah, killing off 3,000 is not too difficult. Not bad. You guys, come on over here and hang out. What is this? Oh, yeah, the general died. That's, that's pretty bad. Whatever happens. Bolivia, you're next. What I could do... Oh, I can command their units. That would actually be probably pretty good. All right, so you guys are getting involved. You guys are come back down here. And we're going to attack these guys next. Hey, 3,000, pretty easy to take out. Let's see if we can do anything good against these guys. We almost have analytic philosophy. You know what? I want you guys to hold first. I want you guys to come back down first. That'd be good. Cool. We're going to come to BAM. Hey, we've got the research points. Let's go ahead and grab army stuff. We need breach loader rifle, so we're going to grab this. So, less combat with. Pretty good. Don't care about this stuff. Alright, so we got both guys. Oh, yeah, this is going to be a slaughter then. Beautiful. We lost 3,000, they lost 18,000, which is ideal. Yeah, we'll both do that, that's fine, whatever. Ooh, Proxis. Prophylaxis against malaria. Hey, minimum life rating's down, that's good. You guys, come on and... Yeah, you can blockade some stuff. Uh-oh. What the heck? No, what? 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 No, 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 A thousand times no. Oh, any more life rating? Oh, the guys have invaded. Oh, that's not too bad. What's the last time? What's the next time we can go to war with Colombia? As long as they aren't getting speared by the UK, that's a, or us or anyone really. That's good. Four years. That's so long. Actually, how is this looking? 
More bureaucrats. I know we need more capitalists here, but I want more intellectuals. We gotta get more intellectuals and really capitalists. We need so much more stuff. Cool. Very good, very good, very good. We're doing pretty darn well, I'd say. Of all nations to ally me. Austria-Hungary. Why? Are you allied with anyone? Oh, you're but mm, No, 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 no. Because I won't be able to help you out. Just like you, we are a multicultural empire. But just like you, we could collapse in a day or two. Ango Chi? Oh, which Ango Chi is it? Is it Ango Chi, Ango Chi, or Ango Chi, Ango Chi? Oh, you're done. Oh, hello. Would you like to be part of an empire? Cool, and we'll start snaking up the coast a little bit more from here on out. Kerman. Very nice. And there you go. I'm going to send you guys over here. Kangans. Just take them out. Just take them out. Take out the navy too. We're getting them pretty quickly, which is pretty nice. And we get some guard units too, which would be very good as well. Hey, level 4. Uh, industry, not bad. We have a few things. Ur Uruguay. Uruguay. God, we need so much more stuff. It's only 1873 though, so. Not too worried about it. Should as. Find them, get rid of them, Bolivia. Hello! There you go, very good. Hey, we got rid of them. Nice. So I, I did check for the great powers. Number nine in the world for power is Spain, and they're not that far away from us, so we gotta make sure we do okay. Hey, more procedural, take that. I will gladly take that. And good job. I'm gonna make my way up to Tehran, so that'll be good. And I wanna kill these guys. Oh, no, just go that way. Kill those guys out just so we can kill, sink their ships. They technically have two, like, capital ships versus our navy, but whatever. Long working hours. The factories extend their flanks of flour brick. One after another, bare with shirtless windows like economical and colossal prisons, and inside, lit by gas jets and deafened by the uproar of their own labor, toil thousands of workmen, penned in, regimented, hands active, feet motionless, all day and every day, mechanically serving their machines. The hard work that the city's workers perform has outraged many, and the committee has been formed to tackle the rough working conditions. We should consider legislation to change this. 14 hour workday? Sure, why not? That sounds not too bad. Only 14 hours? You're not going to have an unlimited hour workday? What is wrong with you all? All right, they come in, and hopefully we can do well against them. We'll see what happens. We might lose a ship here or there. Oh, we did lose a ship. We lost one. It was probably a transport. Yep, and that's why I make more than one at a time. Uh, go and repair for now. Good. Get more support. Have we killed off all the, the navy? Oh, we killed off the entire army. So now it's just free territory. If that's the case, I'm going to lower you just by a little bit first. Just a little bit more. Money is expensive to buy. Should as... Eh, let's not go there. Let's go up to places that have better supply, probably. Yours is 10. This place is actually the same. 10. Oh, that sucks. Hell, Hegelian idealism. Very nice. Very nice. Ooh, we gotta build up a bigger army, too. Get to Kholm. And then we'll take out the capital. Nice. Oh, man. This army's not looking great. It's alright, though. It's alright. We'll deal with this somehow, some way. France, we do like uh, increased relations. Well, thank you very much. We almost have breech loader rifles too. Oh, that's so disappointing that they're over there. We've been doing really well against Persia. Then again, they're, un they're still technically uncivilized, so. Hey, look at that. And get breech loader rifles. Colonial negotiations is exactly what we need. Hey, these are ex we're doing more research for the military, which is good. Combat, lots of combat with us, very, very good, so we can funnel as many soldiers into a very tiny area and have a have battles that last for literal years. Good. Ham? I love ham. Is that ham or... Elam. It might be Elam. I prefer ham. We only 40 war score. That's totally fine with me. Totally, totally fine. 13.3% of our population can read. Not enough, but hey, we're getting there. We're doing the best we can as a West African great power. Uh, take Manchuria. Build... Someone wants me to build ports all across Africa, especially Southern Africa. We'll see what happens. I mean, I'll build ports up regardless, so... Oh, God. Fighting the mountains sucks. Hey, look at that. Nice. Get more capitalists. Yeah, we definitely need to get more capitalists. Hey, Portugal. Wait, uh, it's probably Bolivia now. There we go. That's what we like to see. Hey, it's around as ours. Do you want to capitulate now, or do you want to do it later? Oh, there you go. Nice. They become part of the Tukalor Empire. Go and do that. I'll send you back home, and then go and come down here and come to that region too. 16.7. Uh, actually, just come down here then. 
and we'll add you to us. Nice. Hopefully this helped out the economy. All right, let's slash this a little bit more. We can slash this a little bit more. Up next, what are we building up? Who are we building up? We got you guys done, which is great. Uh, come over there, and then you guys, I'm going to send you back to Uruguay. And then over here, we're going to build up a few more Sheparinos. Probably one. You get two, that's fine. So we can put them back on the transports. And really, there's, I'm not, not surely sure who else to attack. Morocco, is it time to go back to Morocco? No, we still have a truce with them. Until 74. Oh, actually, hmm. Oh, if it's until 74, we can wait till we start justifying. That wouldn't be bad. And give us some more time to just, like, really focus on ourselves. Share our prestige is nice. We're still 8th in the world, but that's kind of what I expected. Let's go ahead and... Who... Ooh, are they allied with UK? They're not. They're by themselves. No thanks. As much as we like you, that's probably not in our best interests. Uh, we can slash this too. Slash taxes like that. There you go. And UK, do you like us? France, do you like us? Oh! Wait, did they... Oh no. Um hmm. They got rid of us. Oh, hello. Germany's at war with Oh. Okay. Well then. This is quite peculiar. Germany, would you like an alliance? I would get an alliance with Germany, but let's watch them fight the wars. Oh, they're losing down there. That's a lot of French soldiers. And they're fighting the Belgians, and they're fighting the Russians. Urgh, I don't know, man. Hey, 29th in the world, not bad. Oh, God. Oh, God, can Germany do it? What is Germany doing? Oh, God, I don't think they can do this. Now they're doing okay against the, the Russians, but we'll see what happens. Uh, I'm still keeping slavery just so that we, have more, we can get more reforms more quickly. I promise I'll get rid of it eventually, but let's get trade unions. Non-socialists allowed. It's not going to be looking good for Germany. Yeah, that's not good. If they can knock out, like, Belgium or Russia quickly enough, I mean, they'll do okay, but... Uh, uh, Colum oh, I want to beat up Colombia, too. How about Haiti? I, at this point, I just want to conquer other people. Dominican Republic is in the American sphere. But really, I think it's Morocco time. Morocco's a nice place, right? Build up some things there. Morocco! Oh, you still gotta wait until... Uh, oh, September 10th. So, right now. Cool! We could do that. We could make him a puppet, but nah, at this point, we just need to annex them. Alright, took a little Persia. Don't mind if we do. And go and do that too. That's fine. Put you on a boat. So we need... So we have two, one, two. So we need two more infantry and three more artillery. Two and then three. <gasps> we have engineers. Well, look at that. Two. And then uno. Dos. Triple. Three. Yeah. 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 Hey, let's get less infamy for now. Saves coming, works, but my goodness, it, it, it does get tiring sometimes. Wait, did we ally you? No, we didn't. That's good. What is UK up to? They haven't allied anyone except the Dutch still. And Boisje Bouchoir. How's the war going? Actually, let's take a look. Yeah? French liberation of Elsass Lothringen? No, I don't know, man. We'll see what happens with that. Oh, they're doing actually pretty darn well. That is big sadness. Germany can't fight a two-front war. Well, I mean, they're doing well against the Russians. The French, not so much. The Belgians, eh. But then again, this is 1874, so what do you expect? Mission to Morocco? Oh, that sucks. Come on, don't get found out. Don't, 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 don't get found out. And as soon as I say that, we're probably going to get found out. Also, let's make sure we do this too. Persia. we got to increase our relations with them since we did take them out, so. I love Persia. Partially westernized nation. Completely under us. Oh, well, they already beasted out, so that kind of sucks for them. But that's just not good. Hmm. So now Germany will probably end up fighting for that territory later on. Oh, good job, France. Now I don't know if I should really ally the Germans. But they are number one in the world. What happened to the UK? Why are they fourth? Seriously, what happened to them? The Iron Ring. Six in the world, huh? How's the Turks doing? Or the Ottomans? Well, they're seventh in the world. And we're eighth, right below them. I don't know, man. I, I really want to ally these guys. I really, really, really do. Baudis, can you come back? What the heck? Everyone is trying to kill Paraguay. I am so sorry, Paraguay. People hate you. All right, let's get a look over here, too. All right. We still got beer. Oh, my God. They take so long to get bureaucrats over here. Why? Intellectuals. It's slowly going up, actually, too. This is not bad. 
And we have our soldiers back here. Very, very good. But that's only one of the groups. We need the other group to come back here too. If that's the case, you know what? Mm. Well, that ain't bad. I'm kind of surprised we didn't have to do anything about that, but hey, I'll take it. Well, let's see. I need you guys back, so come on over. Uh, you can take this group. So we need to go to war by February 9th, 1876. For the love of God, please don't have anyone else come find me. And also, I did read one of your comments saying that if, as long as it's 51% or something like that, at 100%, it's still okay, so. Gotta save every penny we got. Nope. They are secondary power. They're, they're right below. See, we, they're 255. We are at what score? We are at... 302? Actually, that's not too bad. It's a little better. And it's fine. Our ships are taking a while. The race for fertilizers. Uh, we, I think we've already read this. Yeah, Marrakesh is getting sulfurs. Nice. Too bad it's a colonial province. Alright, so head on the boat. Because we already have an army up here, but I want at least another one too. Let's see you guys... Do you have any recruitment mode? Huh. Well, if that's the case, we could probably actually walk through the, the god darn desert, but that's probably a really bad idea. Uh, we'll probably get rid of you, actually. Uh, how are you guys looking over here? No, 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 okay. We're still doing pretty well. Man, that was a fast war against from the Germans, though. Now they probably learned that maybe we shouldn't fight a two-front war. Actually, if they were fighting anyways, how, how big is their military? Oh, they literally have nothing. What am I waiting for? What am I waiting for? Just go and go to war. Take what we can. Declare war. Hopefully no one gets involved. Tarza. Moroccan. Oh, Taza. I mean, Taza. Is this Taza? Oh, we can't get... <gasps> Hello! Precious goods. I like precious goods. It's going to be look, looking real ugly, but I will take some precious goods, man. Call in our allies? Germany will not accept. So let's not call them in, then. Hey! Welcome aboard, everyone. Come to Figug, and you guys come to Fez. We also have breech loader rifles too. That's awesome. Son, son, please. Oh, oh, I thought Egypt is. Uh, I saw all those ships. I'm like, where did they get those ships? And their ships died. Beautiful. Figuig. Tetuan. And we've done this before. Hey, look at that. Better stuff. Machine guns would be cool, ball, but we don't need, really need that right now. Uh, I think it's time we finally start doing some of this stuff. We need nationalism and imperialism. We need secularization. All this good stuff. State and government, though. Nice. I love Morocco. Beautiful. I might go to war. Oh, they actually have Ceuta. I might go to war with Spain later on, too. We'll see what happens. I'm really just trying to think about, like, late game and, like, great wars. Just because we're going to need to prepare ourselves for late wars. Great, great wars, late wars, whatever we call them. Just head on the boat and head on home. You guys come to Casablanca, and you guys do whatever you need to do. Rashida. Yes, there we go. Hello, France. I don't mind howling with you guys, because you guys are pretty good, but pretty ally with the Germans. Let's see what happens. Alright, let's head on home and go to. Hmm. Hmm. Well, actually, I'll probably deposit you guys back here in Rosal. Rosal's a good place to be, right? There we go. Hold on. So what's going on over here? Diplomacy. Show Wars. The Second Oriental Crisis. Egypt. 63. 78. You are at war with those guys. Could we go to war with them, maybe? Maybe? Oh, it's too cool empire. We've got to increase our relations with them, but we don't have enough okay, stuff there. Hmm. So they want to reassert their puppet. Egypt becomes a puppet of the Ottoman Empire. Demand this from these guys. If I go to war with these guys... Ooh, we could maybe do that. We could acquire a state. We could humiliate. And that would really knock down a lot of their prestige. And that would knock them out of great power status, elevating us to level 7 in the world compared to everyone else. And that would secure our great power position quite a bit. But can we really take on these guys? I mean, if we really tried to do so, we probably could. We had to identify the Romanians, though. Which, the Romanians are not super weak. I don't know. I would just like to go to war with Egypt. Make concession? Well. Hmm. I'm thinking we might do that. Hmm. I don't want to get found out, though. So. Oh, let's go and lower the budget, too. There we go. 
go all the way this time. Keep spending money, doing a good job, doing whatever we need to do. Eight in the world. 14% of our population can read still. Not bad. Actually, how's the migration doing? Any internal migration anywhere? Anyone leaving Uruguay? No? Dahomey integration? Look at this! Look. The Tikular Empire has maintained control over Dahomey for us to consider the possibility of integrating it into the Tikular Empire as a whole. There are Tikular flags waving in Jugu, flown by Tikular citizens, so it does not seem so far-fetched that an idea that Dahomey may eventually be considered Tikular Tukul territory by the world at large. We should begin integrating them. Oh, we oh we lose infamy! Oh, we get infamy! No! Ooh. So be it. That is worth it. That is absolutely worth it. Oh, we can get... What was it? Is this... That's Ghana. Jugu, yeah, right here. That'd be great to have it under us. That'd be really great. I would love to have it under us. Oh, the armaments. Oh, muzzle-loaded rifle armaments. Very cool. Oh, ow, yeah. And even if we want to colonize, we've got to make sure we got some naval bases, too. I almost forgot about that. We've got to get some naval bases. But I think I'll end the episode here and start doing some uh, stuff off screen. Maybe we can go to war with uh, the Egyptians. Maybe, maybe not. But regardless, hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow when the race for colonizing might begin between the world powers. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.